to my kitchen where tonight we're gonna teach you how to make I don't know if that is a Korean, Japanese, Chinese, Latin accent but tonight we're cooking cauliflower sushi but I was craving sushi like a lot of us we live in a sushi culture right yeah everybody loves to go on sushi dates Sushi nights, people are taking sushi classes, so they're trying to make sushi at home. So I call him and I said, you know, homie, homie, I'm craving sushi. Can you hook it up with something that's gonna be a little guilt free? And he comes out with what kind of sushi? Cauliflower sushi. Yeah, boy. So we're hooking up cauliflower sushi. This is what you're gonna need. All right, so you're gonna need some oyster sauce or hoisin sauce. You're gonna need some soy sauce. This is low sodium. If you like, this is balsamic vinaigrette, or balsamic glaze. Sesame seeds. You got some pansu lemon juice uh, seasoning. And some rice vinegar, okay? That's all you need. You can get this anywhere at any Asian market, or you can go to Walmart as well. We have our cut vegetables. Here we have bell peppers, the red and the green. Carrots, the baby cucumbers. You have an avocado, and you have baby corn. Look at that, baby, baby corn. You also have some shrimp, whatever you like to fill it up with, some salmon, Alaskan salmon, and some crab in mayo. And last but not least, you're also gonna need some seaweed paper. So you can find these at also any Asian market. And then one of these uh, sushi rollers. You can make it yourself as well. So there you go. So my question is, is how the hell are you gonna make cauliflower sushi? Simple, let me show you. I think you watching this, you're probably confused right now too, but it's about to go down. Exactly. So, we're gonna substitute the rice with cauliflower, and we have here a food processor, so you're gonna need a food processor for sure. Um, I have the, uh, the blade that's like, that does like the cheese grating and stuff like that, and I also have the regular blade down here as well. So go ahead and put that in there like this. And you're gonna take one whole head of cauliflower, chop it up into little bits, okay? And then they're gonna be like this small. And then you're gonna go put it in here. Oh, there you go. And then you're gonna turn it on. There you go. And you do it little by little. And see, it comes out as a, like a little grainy rice there for you. Okay, and you're also gonna take at least a quarter of an avocado because this is what's gonna make it stick together instead of being loose and and uh, and watery because cauliflower does retain a lot of water. It's gonna look a little green because of the avocados, but no worries, okay? When you're making the cauliflower rice in your food processor, you're gonna wanna add about two capfuls of the rice vinegar and also about two spoonfuls of the pansu sauce. So that way it gives it that rice flavor, okay? So now you're gonna take your seaweed wraps. I have two layers, okay, just in case. It just depends which one you buy. One can be thick, one can be thin. These are thin. So you're gonna put these two on top of your uh, sushi roll mat. You're gonna take your cauliflower rice with avocado. And now you can take whatever topping you want and put it in your roll. Do some carrots some cucumbers, uh, I got some, the red bell peppers. I'll do a little bit of salmon. And then avocado, let me get a spoon here. You're gonna roll it kinda like a taco, like a burrito, basically. All right, let's see, let's hope, and hold on to this. Squish, squish, and then you're gonna bring it back a little bit more. And then you're gonna. This is talent, it. guys. This is talent and art. It has to be tight, Erika. I'm trying to. There you go. So there you go. And you want to give it a little squish there. And there you go. Sushi roll. Yeah. All right, you need a real sharp knife for you to cut these rolls, so. If not, it'll be a terrible disaster. <laughs> it will, so I'm kind of nervous right now. And 
And I know these are a little bit thick, but depending on the knife you have, the sharper the knife, the better the cut that you can make with your sushis. What did I tell you, my friend? One dollar, one dollar sushi. <laughs> no, seriously, you guys, cauliflower sushi? Look at the presentation on this. Like, la comida no solamente tiene que ser rica, pero también, you have to make it look so good that your guests are gonna wanna dig in. So la única cosa que le falta a eso is a little bit of ginger, a little bit of low sodium soy sauce on the side. And I don't know about you, but we could call this a date night and you could seriously either impress somebody you're dating, your husband, your wife, and just blow their socks off with healthy sushi. Cauliflower sushi, anybody? Thank you for the love. Thank you for loving my videos. And guess what? There's a lot more of these cool videos coming soon.